Many people come to me because they have this heaviness uh, they've been carrying around with them their whole lives, uh, this emotional weight, and they want to get rid of it. This heaviness is made of the same stuff in all of us. It's made of negative beliefs about ourselves and about the world, and it's made of dysfunctional ways of thinking. Many people think that the way to get rid of this is positive thinking, is, is kind of like humans are a hot air balloon. That if you keep giving it more and more fuel, if you keep giving it more and more positive energy, then it'll keep you up and it'll, it'll prevent you from drifting downward. Not only is this approach unsustainable, but it's exhausting. A gas balloon, on the other hand, it's very different. It can still carry you, uh, but the lift is already there. I think this is how humans really are. We're born optimistic, curious, and driven. But it's these sandbags, these negative beliefs, and these negative ways of thinking that, that hold us back and keep us grounded. And a, a really good example of this is, is a little kid trying to walk for the first time. At no point does that kid just sit down, cross his arms, and go, no, there's no way. There's no way I'm going to walk because he hasn't learned any limitations yet. So he just keeps going and keeps working because there's nothing that's between him and the thing that he wants. So later in life, we learn these limitations. We learn, I can't, or I'm not enough. So just like the sandbags that keep the gas balloon grounded, these beliefs and these dysfunctional ways of thinking, they, they keep us from our full potential. The only way to progress in a long-term sustainable way is to simply cut the sandbags free the unhelpful thought patterns, they have to go. That is how you really get results. That is how you rise.